Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for June the 8th. Today we mark the death in 1492 of Elizabeth Woodville in Bermondsey Abbey. Now, she was the mother of Elizabeth of York and also the Princess in the Tower. She was the grandmother to Henry VIII. But Henry, of course, wouldn't have remembered his grandmother. The relationship between Elizabeth Woodville and her son-in-law's family continues be, to be the stuff of historical fiction writers. It's possible that she angered Henry VII after supporting early rebellions against him, though why she would have done that and jeopardized her daughter's position as queen is curious. If she did participate in any rebellion, it likely meant that she believed that her sons were still alive. She had a tumultuous life that paralleled the Wars of the Roses. She was widowed early on when her husband was killed in battle. Then she catches the eye of Edward IV and married him. Their marriage, while a love match, still revolved around the civil wars. She fled to sanctuary more than once. She actually gave birth in sanctuary of Westminster Abbey during one period. You can imagine that by the time her daughter was on the throne as queen, she was likely tired and she wanted a quiet life. So she joined the abbey, left the court politics to others. Still, it does leave people wondering how she could have abandoned court if there hadn't been drama. That's your Tudor Minute for today. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast at englandcast.com, where there is an episode on Elizabeth Woodville.